used very heavily in the insurance world where there are only two states which are typically the alive and the dead state right generally when i am looking at uh, between the alive and the dead okay there is uh, only one transition between these two states at some point in time a person who is alive when uh, with some particular age right probably if i am assuming that x is the age of the person uh, at some particular point in time there is a transition to a death state and uh, probably the force of transition here we'll define one word called the force of transition or the transition rate right transition rate is what we denote by mu x generally this mu x is assumed to be constant within one year assumed to be constant during a one year period so probably whether he die whether the person is aged 55.5 uh, uh, or 55.7 or whatever it is it is assumed to be constant during a one year kind of a period so one thing is in a two state markov model we are more looking at a person being alive moving to a dead state right whatever uh, uh, depending on his age x so x is the age of the person so when i say mu x the 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 force of intensity or force of uh, transition probably a person who is uh, uh, generally people at very high age let's say 75 or 80 the force of transition to death is very high because more number of people uh, i mean there's a good chance of uh, dying but probably for a person with age 30 the force of transition could be much lesser so that's the reason why we say the force of transition is based on the age x so that's where uh, sometimes this force of transition is also being called as force of mortality the chance of uh, dying or even uh, uh, or even uh, typically the hazard rate right it just not uh, i mean it need